Well, they say that in business, competition is good, right? Well, things are certainly heating up as the ports of LA and Long Beach team up to outdo our East Coast rivals. Gil Reyes explains. July 5th, 1934. A clash between striking longshoremen and San Francisco police killed two people and injured hundreds more. Though tragic, the incident known as Bloody Thursday led to improved working conditions and a new union for dock workers up and down the West Coast. More recently, dock workers had another battle over wages. LA Mayor Eric Garcetti stepped in to help cut a deal, end the strike, and get business moving again. And guess what? To everybody who said, it was going to tank the trade here. This last quarter was a record quarter for the Port of Los Angeles. The most cargo ever moved in our history. These days, the anniversary of Bloody Thursday is a celebration with music, dancing, and LA's mayor filling in on keyboards. Meantime, dock workers gear up for yet another fight, a battle for dominance against competing ports in the East Coast. The anniversary comes as rival ports from New York to Houston pour a lot of money into infrastructure projects to improve their facilities. Add to that the recent widening of the Panama Canal to accommodate larger ships, and the competition between ports has never been this fierce. The mayor says the ports of LA and Long Beach must upgrade to stay number one. Projects like raising cranes to accommodate the new wave of taller ships and teamwork between both cities are part of the game plan. So Mayor Robert Garcia of Long Beach and I have come together, got federal uh, approval for an unprecedented collaboration where we're sharing truck chassis, where we're looking at environmental issues together, where we're making sure that labor moves smoothly between both. Our ports have built-in advantages. For starters, we're closer to Asia, where 70% of imports by sea originate. California also has bridges tall enough to accommodate newer, taller ships, while the longshoremen of LA and Long Beach say they're the best. So if you bring your container ships here or you bring your steel ships here, uh, the workforce here in Los Angeles and Long Beach uh, can move any type of cargo better, faster and quicker anywhere than anybody else in the world. Raising cranes and raising the bar in the battle for business. At the Port of Long Beach, I'm Gil Reyes for LA This Week.